Carl, I had a burning question for you, which we discussed uh, offline before this uh, presentation. Uh, you mentioned um, in quantum computing, you mentioned this term qubits, uh, and I didn't understand it. So for any listeners who don't know what a qubit is in context of quantum computing, maybe you could explain. Sorry to put you on the spot, but I'm sure you can, I'm sure you can explain it. Oh God, this, well, this will be a really terrible explanation for those that are <laughs> far more cleverer than me. But the way I've kind of had it explained to me in the past is that, that a normal computer um, that we all use today, that we're using to record this kind of podcast on, uses bits, B-I-T-S. Um, and each bit um, is, is, is either a, a zero or a one. So computer code, it's all zero or ones. You know, you, you're going to, the, the light switch is either on or off. It can do those kind of calculations. Um, whereas uh, that, they're classed as binary systems. Whereas if you uh, start talking about qubits, um, a qubit can be a zero or a one or a zero and a one at the same time. So what that means is um, that it can, rather than just run one objective at a time, it can run multiple scenarios. So a good way to think about it is if you're in a maze and you're looking for your way out of the maze, you're usually only going to just try one path at a time, aren't you? You're going to like, right, I'll turn right. Can I get to the end? No, right, I'll try another one. Whereas uh, like a quantum computer in qubits will just try all the paths at the same time. So it just massively increases the scope and power for kind of, you know, looking for solutions for things. So it could be absolutely amazing for advances in medical, you know, science and things like that, because at the moment, the standard computers have to try, you know, one, one check at a time, whereas you can plug something into the quantum computer, it's going to just check tons of different scenarios all at once. So the speed of process is just going to be amazing.